Well, this is Andrew Stotts of A. Stotts Investment Research, and I'm sitting here on my balcony in Bangkok, Thailand. And the reason why I'm doing this video is because my business partner, Alex Wetterling, he asked me, why don't you explain to people why you chose to do a podcast? And why did you call it my worst investment ever? Well, the reason why I, I got started on the podcast concept is because I listen to John Lee Dumas all the time, every single day when I walk at the park near the house here. And I've been listening to his podcast for, since it came out. I always knew that I wanted to talk. I wanted to have a voice on the podcast. But really, I looked at every, every different idea and it just... It seemed like it either already been done or it was going to be another story of, you know, hey, I'm going to interview hotshot investors and all that. And then I got this idea of doing my worst investment ever. Stories of loss to keep you winning. The idea being is that, you know, how do people lose money? Why do people lose money? What are the common mistakes? My worst investment ever interviews people from around the world, professionals and non-professionals, and tries to figure out, you know, what are the mistakes that they made and how can we then come up with a, an understanding of that so that we don't make those mistakes again and young people don't make them. Already I've been pulling together to make a, actually a short course out of this of how do we protect our wealth based upon what I've learned. In fact, so far I've learned that there's 15 core mistakes in startup business or in investing that people have made. I'll have more on that coming out. But meanwhile, enjoy the show. We've got great people that I've interviewed and I continue to get interviewees. In addition, I asked my friends across the world if they had a story of their worst investment ever, could they write it down and send it to me? Believe it or not, I got 500 stories. So I'm rolling those out in an anonymous fashion. And again, I don't want to shame anybody. If someone doesn't want to be disclosed, that's fine. Or if somebody wants to talk and they don't want to talk about the exact detail, that's fine. The point is we want to learn the lessons. So I hope that that helps explain why I did it and what I'm doing. And my goal is to interview as many people as possible about their worst investment ever and try to help the future generation to not make the same mistakes that we did. Have a great day.